Hi guys, um, Jan Eriksson here from Campus Sweden. Kristian Eriksson here from Campus Sweden. Uh, today we're going to talk about and show you the fourth section from the WDT system. And it's very similar to the first. You're here, as you know in the first section you're going in that direction. In the fourth you go in the other direction, so you get both arms going the other way. And that's what it's all about. Enjoy! So here in the fourth section I'm attacking Christian's center line with a lanza or an elbow to his uh, chest. Of course, I can't just stop with uh, taking his uh, arms. I need to attack, so I straighten up and attack Christian's chest with a punch. Where you can see here in the slow motion part, I'm actually uprooting, just making Christian leave the ground and punch him. Christian defends using a Tansa to defend the uh, upper attack. So my punch. Of course, I can't uh, just stand there. So I, while he's defending with his Tansa, I change arm and attack his uh, throat or head with a punch using both arms at the same time. Christian defends using his same tansa, but he's going out a bit more and making his position a bit stronger to um, deflect my uh, power to his uh, head. Just after doing this uh, tansa, he attacks my center line with a double punch to my upper and lower part of my torso. So in a very short moment, he's actually doing a tanso and then a double punch. I deflect by turning and using my arms, making his arms go in another direction and just take his force away. And of course not stopping there, but immediately after that, attacking Christian's center line with a double punch both to his abdomen and to his chest. That completes the, the final part of the fourth section and this last part here could go on in a loop so he could of course then uh, do the same defense and attack me with a double punch again. I hope you enjoyed uh, this video and see you next week for a new video from Come for Sweden and don't forget to leave comments and subscribe. See you then. Ciao.